Okay, so this is our initial warehouse conveyor control activity for factory I.O. It involves traffic keeping for multiple incoming conveyors as the pallets approach a transfer point for consolidation onto a single outbound conveyor. What I have done for this so far is to map the factory I.O. inputs and outputs to my PLC as shown here. The logic is fairly straightforward. Pallets can approach the intersection from the left, center, or right side based on the current point of view. And depending on the incoming direction, the system will raise or lower the unload lift on the transfer unit and will run the rollers either clockwise or counterclockwise. All other conveyors need to be stopped while a pallet is being transferred. And when the pallet clears the unload sensor, the transfer logic can be reset. As you can see, the incoming pallet triggers one of the three photo eyes indicating the direction from which it is coming. The system is then able to determine the direction the rollers need to turn and when to raise the unload lift. But since you're watching this video, you know it can't be that easy. What you just saw happen was that the trailing pallet coming from the lower right of the screen has been abandoned in the middle of the transfer unit. Let me play that for you again. Are you able to see the cause of the problem? If not, don't feel too bad. It took me a while to figure it out as well. The problem is that the first pallet clears the transfer unit as it passes this photo eye, indicating that the pallet is clear. But because the trailing pallet has already entered the transfer unit's envelope, it is being lowered onto the rollers instead of being allowed to continue through. And here we have the corrected logic that ensures that a trailing pallet on the middle incoming conveyor is allowed to continue through the transfer unit if necessary. The remainder of the video just shows the system continuing to run as pallets are randomly added to each of the three incoming lines. The advanced version of this program will only have a small segment from the left and right conveyors stop, allowing for pallets to accumulate closer to the transfer point. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.